where we are tonight, what we're doing here. Uh, we're in, um, is this officially Brentwood? I, I think it's like Brentwood Village or something like that. And we're at the Sicario Day of the Soldado premiere, uh, the follow-up to the Smash Academy Award nominated Sicario. What can uh, fans of the first film expect from this film? Um, it's got some of the old characters, Josh and Benny and I, and, uh, and, a, and a host of whole new other ones that um, are just uh, darker, meaner, and badder. And um, it's, uh, it's a bigger movie than the first one, and uh, a little more action, and kind of like Sicario on steroids. How is this film kind of, it's a sequel, but it's not standalone at the same time? Yeah, it's not. I don't. I don't consider it a sequel, other than it's the characters, a few characters from the first. But it's really the tone and the and the story of who, who these guys are fighting, and that is uh, a very bad cartel that's kind of destroying the border of our country. And um, and Benny and and uh, and Josh, uh, interestingly, in this film, go are at odds with each other. And How is it working with some movies like? Uh, Matthew and, uh, and Catherine and Isabella, oh my god, Dora, Dora the Explorer, yeah, um, amazing, just amazing, I'm, I've been a fan of his since Vision Quest and I told him that first day, I was like, I'm sorry, I'm just going to talk about Vision Quest this whole shoot. <laughs> what did uh, Stefano bring to the role of the director that no one else could for this film? He brought his, his unique perspective, which is, um, he's fluent in English, but his visual style is 100% Italian filmmaking, and so... Uh, he had such an incredible vision, and he stuck to it. 